Hi guys, how are you doing? My name is Neil. Today we're going to check out another pedal by Sonic Ake and this is called Sonic IR. Okay guys, so it's pretty obvious from the name what pedal we're looking at today. This is a Sonic Ake IR loader pedal. I've used IRs before, in fact I use them all the time and use them a lot. So first of all, let's unbox this thing, let's read some of the blurb and find out exactly what this thing is, although it is pretty obvious. In the box you get, what well, I'm assuming in this little bag is quite a, whoa, that's gone. Quite a cute little um, USB connector there. That cable will go straight into your Mac or your PC or your laptop or whatever it is that you use to uh, get your IRs from the computer, the Mac to the pedal. That being said, for those of you that don't want to bother with a PC, a Mac or loading in your own IRs, don't worry, don't panic because Sonic Kick have got you covered because this comes with IRs already built into the thing and from what I hear from other YouTubers and other people, they are actually pretty good as well. Today, the demo that we'll be doing I will actually be showing you the IRs that are built into this thing. I won't be loading my own IRs in on this video, but I will put them in there on another video. But today I just want to check out exactly what the IRs sound like on this actual product um, as it is out of the box. So from the look of this thing, I'll just show you it there close up. I hope you guys can see exactly what I'm holding up there. It looks like we can get 11 different IRs onto this thing. We can control the volume here at the top on this toggle here your usb connection where you can load irs in and out is there your other pedals preamp pedals distortion pedals whatever will go in at this side you can then come out of this side and go into anything that you desire however the cool thing about this pedal which i didn't know was it has an xlr there this is so you can go direct xlr into a mixing desk you know to use this thing live or you can use it in a recording studio and you can use either a normal trs style jack or you can use an xlr that's pretty cool that's a really good idea and uh, they've done really well to actually fit that on a pedal this size because this is a mini pedal if you are wanting to purchase anything by sonic Kit, go down there in the description there's an affiliate link if you go through that link and purchase anything it helps support the channel i've not used an ir pedal before but i've been wanting one for quite a while the only time I've really used IRs in a pedal is when it's been like a multi-effects like a Moa G300 or my Zoom multi-effects. I've never actually used it in a little pedal like this. I do have some cool preamp pedals that I can put into this thing. I have one by Blackstar, which is the dual drive, and I also have a Moa um, 005 brown sound pedal, which is one of the best little mini pedals you can buy as far as preamp pedals go. Um, I will try that into this pedal. The guitar that I'm going to use today is going to be my trusty Green Glow Ash DK2 by Jackson Guitars. Let's get on with it. Let's go. I'm pretty excited to use this thing. <laughs>